Good morning, YouTube. Good morning, subscribers on my channel. Um, I haven't done a video for a long time, but I'm just doing this right now, raw, no planning, because I don't think I need any planning because of what's happened recently. So let me fill you in if you don't already know. I was playing football, uh, was it last Wednesday? I was playing football on uh, Wednesday, last Wednesday, Wednesday the, whatever it was, Wednesday the 15th or what, I don't know what day it was. Anyway, I was playing football um, just, over, just over a week ago and, you know, it was training, I was playing pretty well, I was playing on a different surface to normal. It was a hard surface and pop went my Achilles. Pop went my Achilles. Um, it was a really loud bang. No one was near me at the time. I was just receiving the ball in a half turn, turn, you know, how you do turn on a pitch, look up. As I received the ball, um, I heard something go pop. I looked down at my left foot I was like, what was that? It doesn't feel good. It felt like I was like floating. It felt like I was stepping on like a hill. Anyway, so I fell to the ground quickly because obviously I couldn't put any weight on it. I was hopping, so I put, fell to the ground and I looked and I thought to myself, this is an Achilles because I've seen it. I've seen it happen to someone else on the football pitch and it's happened to my friend, a couple of my friends. And uh, so, yeah, I knew straight away. Fortunately, there was no pain. So I was sat there and I was like, can someone get me some painkillers? Because I was waiting for the pain. I thought that the adrenaline was going through my body at the time. So hence why I didn't feel no pain. So at this point, I was actually quite scared of the pain. Like I was waiting for it to, uh, to, to come, to come on. But there was no pain. There was no pain. They carried me to the side of the pitch. And that's when I um, rang my mum. <laughs> uh, so she helped me. Um, so... I was going to get to pick her up, but her sense of direction is appalling. So where I was, it wasn't the easiest place to find. So someone, a friend that was playing with me at the time, he dropped me to to, to hospital and I met my mum there. I could not put no weight on that foot. My Achilles has snapped, like snapped, ruptured. I'm not sure how bad it is because I'm still awaiting the surgery, but I went to the hospital and they saw me, they bandaged me up. Um, I'll put some pictures up now. And yeah, so so that 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 was it really. Um, out. So that means I'm now out of the game, out of the game. Obviously, Olympia is meant to be in December. If it does go ahead, it's in December. My prep for that has obviously now come to a halt. I cannot train. I cannot go to the gym. Can't do no cardio. It, well, you know, the cardio that I like to do. Um, the whole point of this football was to do cardio. Obviously, um, it's a you know a bad mistake on my behalf, but accidents happen. Um, so yeah, so no Olympia, and I'm just basically housebound now, so I can do more videos, I guess. But yeah, so I'm just here. Um, I just thought let me just update you just in case you haven't uh, seen any news or anything along those lines. Um, but what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna try and report back to you guys at least weekly on how I'm getting on and how I'm progressing and still training my this is my this is what I am trying to tell you is that you can still do stuff when you have no legs <laughs> I literally like I will show you my boot in a minute but I literally cannot I've got crutches so I'm on crutches and it's hard. I can't drive at the moment because I haven't got an automatic car. So I need to get that. I need to get an automatic car. And, you know, to get myself around. So it's very inconvenient what, what what's happened right now. Um, but my main aim of these videos, of this series, is to, to sh try and inspire you that, you know, whenever there's things that are going against you, you can still push forward. Um... And yes, like I'm a person at the beginning, it's like, oh man, this is not good. But then I look at the positives. What, okay, what can I do now? I'm going to focus on my business, focus on my clients and still do something about my own physique at the same time. 
okay because i see this as just a little blip in a journey because it can happen it happens to everyone but it's how you deal with it all right so um hopefully you can follow my journey on staying in shape even with obviously this injury and then watch my journey of my recovery and then obviously back into the gym and um hopefully this can hopefully motivate yourself and inspire you to keep doing the stuff that we should be doing training eating well staying disciplined staying focused um and still having the joys of your cheat meals your off-plan meals whatever you want to call them um implemented in your own life but you can still get the results that you want so let me show you my boot so here we go here's my boot guys um good old back to the future boot um this is a platform that you have to put on like so obviously i've just come out of bed um so you take that platform off when you're sleeping but obviously when you can obviously start walking around you put the platform on um and you know obviously it protects your foot and it helps the foot be it, put, it helps the foot uh, to be placed in an angle for the Achilles to heal. So anyway, so I've had my MRI scan and um, now I'm just awaiting results and awaiting their feedback whether to have surgery or not. So I need to wait for the feedback from the ankle specialist to kind of give me some kind of um, go ahead of what I should do. I would, I don't know, it depends on the severity of it because... You know, if it's really bad and they said that it's a big gap, then I'll maybe go for surgery. But I would, I would want to do it naturally if I can. But if not, then we'd go through the surgical route. But yeah, that's where I'm at the moment. Um, I'm actually going to do my foot. I haven't trained for like, I don't know, since that, since that happened. So it's like, uh, it's like ten days. I haven't trained for ten days. So today I'm going to do a bit, some push ups, some sit ups. Probably not sit ups today. Just push ups. So I can go on my knees. And um, I've got a pull-up bar, so I'm going to use a pull-ups as well. So that's what I'll do today. Just I'll do like a super set of push-ups and, and pull-ups. Um, I'll show you on another video, but this video is more about giving you an update of where I am at, at the moment. Um, so, yeah, anyway, uh, I'll try and do at least one of these a week to keep you updated on what's going on. But, yeah, so, all right. Thank you for watching. And, um, yeah, don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and I will see you soon.